Hiding in the mountains in late summer and there's been lots of rain, the trails are going to be really wet and you'll find mud holes around every turn. Most people will drive around them and continue their ride, but the people known as mudders simply cannot pass up any mud hole. Their personal challenge for the day is to see just how muddy they can get. It's an addiction. They simply have to hit these mud holes, even knowing they may not make it out of them. Their friends tend to egg them on. Well, you can feel when you're losing traction in your tires and kind of like where you are in the ruts. So if you move, keep moving your tires and they'll keep grabbing, it'll kind of get you through the, get you through the hole. Yeah, once my dad got stuck, I wanted to get through there, but I hit the same exact line that he did and it didn't work out. <laughs> I did that on purpose, but it didn't work out. I had, to, I had to find a rag to wipe my mouth out with because my shirt was soaked. <laughs> Do it, don't lick your lips after you go through it either. <laughs> Every trail system has wet areas and some have become famous. Mud holes so deep there is no doubt you're going to have to be winched out. Right, you can definitely avoid the mud. These trails are under constant maintenance at some point. Uh, we're riding today on the other end of the trail system. There's a construction crew that's actually building new trails. So we've constantly got crews out keeping these trails in the best condition possible. Four by four events include mud pits as part of their activities because they know mudding is a huge crowd favorite. Just ask any mudder what their favorite part of riding is. They're going to answer, riding in the mud. They truly love it. We'll be right back with more 4x4 Adventures on Crazy Industries, America's 4x4 Invasion. <laughs> 